Hi, my name is Tatiana Batamarco, and I teach food studies here at Bennington College. The food studies program that I teach in is um, what we call a community engaged program. That means that a lot of the work that we do in the classroom is work in collaboration with the community with um, food banks, community organizations, and local farms with the goal of decreasing food insecurity in Bennington. The hope is that by contributing to a more robust food system here locally in Bennington, that we can help eliminate food insecurity and poverty in the region. Some of the courses that I teach our um, introduction to the food system, which is a course in which uh, as a class we explore this concept of the food system, which includes everything from farms to the environment to the consumer to stores to restaurants and then all the way through the system to food waste um, and back into the land again. Another course that I teach is Resilience and Food Access in Bennington, which is a course that introduces students to the concept of resilience and resilience theory as it applies to food systems. Um, you know, what makes a society or a culture or a community more resilient in terms of everybody having access to high quality nutritious food. And in that course, we don't just explore resilience, Theoretically, we also do it on the ground. And so this past term, what we did was we completed what was called a market basket study, where we went into all of the stores in Bennington that accept um, EBT, electronic benefit transfer, uh, SNAP, which is the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, it used to be called Food Stamps. So we go into all of the stores that accept that. And we checked out like what kind of food was available in those stores and how much did it cost to look at, you know, what is the price of food in our town and what is the availability of food in our town. Um, and, you know, every term we partner with different community organizations and do different hands on projects in order to explore this both um, in our own lives, like what does it mean to be a resilient human being, uh, as well as in our community. And what does this look like and how can we contribute to a world in which everyone gets to eat um, fresh and nutritious food. So uh, please do feel, to contact, feel free to contact me if you have any questions or if you wanna reach out, if you're interested in food studies or sustainable agriculture. Um, I also uh, do some uh, feminist theory, which in my class, uh, Gender, Agriculture and Subsistence, we read some of the feminist theory on agriculture and subsistence practices, which are practices in which people are providing for themselves, such as growing their own food, making their own clothing, um, making their own medicines. Uh, so yeah, I look forward to hearing from you.